I'm Ken McDill, and this is my sports blog. Okay, so it happened. The NBA has started its playoff season and included two teams with losing records, the 40 and 42 Boston Celtics and the 38 and 44 Brooklyn Nets, and did not let in the 45 and 37 Oklahoma City Thunder. This was because the Thunder play in the Western Conference, which currently has more good teams than the Eastern Conference. A meeting this spring between team owners will decide a number of issues in front of the league, and one of them is the possibility of eliminating such an event from occurring in the future. There are also some NBA observers who are pushing for a complete removal of conference and division standings, although I can't imagine anyone wants a 30-team single table. I love standings. I've watched standings since I was a little kid, waking up to the newspaper every morning to see if there was any movement in the National League or American League standings in baseball. And I'm old enough to remember when those were two tables of 10 teams each without divisions. In the NBA, which I have covered professionally for most of my adult life, the divisions provide some in-season competition. The division titles mean something, even if the league has reduced its meaning of the promise of a first-round playoff series home court advantage. I don't want that to ever change. Making winning a division meaningful is important, and I don't mind if a team with a losing record from one conference gets in while a team with a winning record in another conference does not. There will be a time soon when the Eastern Conference is dominant. Tim Duncan and Dirk Nowitzki can't play forever. But I will accept the idea that a team with a winning record that can't break the top eight in its own conference could steal a playoff spot from the other conference if there is a losing team in the top eight over there. This year, I would suggest letting OKC take Brooklyn's spot as the eighth seed, which would create a first-round matchup between the Thunder and the Atlanta Hawks in the East. That might be fun. I'm Ken McDill. Thanks for watching my sports blog.